Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Bumblebee Corner. My name is Lisa. Today I am going to give you a thrift haul. I got some stuff at the local St. Vincent de Paul, and I also went thrifting the other day at the Salvation Army. So I'm gonna let you know what I got. So let's get started. All right, so the first thing I got, I found this, it's just a wood frame, um, but I really liked the floral. And then it has, it says, I love you for seeing me as I wish I were, for hearing what I mean, and not just what I say, for knowing how I feel, for helping me to grow. I will probably paint the frame, I don't know, I was thinking maybe like a pink or a blue, or there's some green, so just something um, to make it pop a little bit more. And then I also got, it's a Thorndike Century Junior Dictionary. This was, oh, I guess I should tell. I always forget to do this. This was $1.99, and the dictionary was also $1.99. So I just, I love the vintage. I love how it looks. Um, I sometimes... I know a lot of people use these like to decoupage something. So I don't know. I haven't quite decided if I'm just going to sell this as is or if I'm going to tear it apart and do something else with it. This is just a big, it's like a bowl, but it's pottery and it's handmade. I believe it's signed Donna O'Neill. But I just, I love, it's kind of like the wicker look. And then the blues and greens. And then I, this was $5.99. And then I also got this cake topper, which was $3.99. I actually found this first. But I thought, I love. So I'm going to sell these together as a set. I just, I really, I loved how that looked together. So I found the cake topper first. And then I was looking for a plate to put it on. And then I found that and thought that looked perfect together. And then I found this basket. Thought it was kind of unique. I do like the color of it. This was a dollar ninety nine also, but I thought just with either just maybe a Christmas tree or just some greenery in there, that would look great. Then I also found three of these. They were ninety nine cents each, just like a bowl filler, but I don't like the silver color, so I'm probably gonna paint these. I thought maybe just maybe like a fall color. Maybe just to put in a basket or a bowl. This bowl I found. It has kind of like a coppery finish. It was $1.99. And it originally is from Pier 1 Imports. But I did like the color for fall. So I grabbed that. I also found, here's a wine rack for $3.99, but I'm actually going to, I have a whole bunch of rolling pins I need to upcycle, so I'm going to use this in one of my booths to display some of the rolling pins. Then I found these. It's rosette and timbali recipes, but it's from Nordic Wear, but I thought these were kind of cool. And I'm not really sure, but they're all little... So there's a heart, it's like a little rectangle. This is just a fun little design, like a little flower rosette. Here's a circle. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with these. So if you have ideas, leave me a comment and another flower. And then it came with this too, I'm assuming on there somehow but anyway it's all there we go so I don't know if somehow you must screw them on there I have no clue so tell me what this is and what it's for I just loved all the little pieces for it so I thought well I'm gonna grab it and figure out what to do with it later all right, so then I found these. These were 99 cents. Again, I think I've done these before. Um, they're little photo holders, but I think they would be cool to snip off and put on top of like a vintage block or any type of little thing like that. So I thought that was cool. 
This is, this was 99 cents, just a napkin holder. This is actually for myself. I'm gonna upcycle it. I've been wanting something to put napkins in. So I'm just gonna upcycle that for me. And then this was $1.99. So it's just a, just a wood box. I thought this would be cool if I could upcycle it. Maybe paint it a Christmas color. Again, a Christmas tree or just do um, some molds or something on there. So we'll see, that'll be in a future upcycle. And then actually here was this too. This actually I got from a friend free, um, another wine rack, and I'm going to use that to display some rolling pins. Okay, so now these next items, they all came from the Salvation Army down on Hall Road, which is, um, I think it's Shelby Township in Michigan. So I saw this, this was pretty cool. <clears throat> it was $5.99. But it's like a little sewing box, so it has all kinds of containers or little things to organize things. So I thought this would even be cool just to put up here, open it up, open them up, and just you could display things in here. So I just thought then it does have little, so I don't know, this might get an upcycle or I may just throw it in my booth as is for now. Um, and then just see what happens. This is just a box. This was $6.99. So it has all these drawers. So I thought this would be cool. This will definitely get a makeover to paint and then put like a, either some transfers or decoupage on the front. So I've got lots of, lots of things I can do with that. So that will also be a future upcycle. And I found this little tear tray. There was a price on I think this was like two or three ninety nine. I don't see the price on here. It must have fallen off. But this is just a small little tear tray, so I really like that. That'll probably go in my booth. I think these are probably yeah, too big to put in there, but just all kinds of little things. So I grabbed that. This is actually for me also, I think. This was $5.99. I've wanted a Lazy Susan just to put little projects on here so I can kind of spin them and so, but this is, it's pretty nice. So <clears throat> I don't know, it might also get painted and get a little something on there or I'll just leave it. This I thought was really cool. I'm guessing like a cake mold. This was $5.99. It's a sheep. This I will just leave as is but I thought it was really cool. So it's like, I think, I believe it's aluminum maybe. So that will be going in my booth and I won't do anything to that. I'll put that right in there. And then I found this little wall pocket. This was $2.99. So it has some floral. So I thought this would be cool. I'll paint it a different color and then just stick some floral in there. So I thought that was cool. And then I found just these little snowmen, salt and pepper <clears throat> holders. I thought they were cute, little angel snowmen. I believe these were $2.99. Those ones didn't have a price, but I bought some other ones and they were $2.99. And then I found this basket, which was also $2.99. It's just kind of a heavy duty. I really like that. I thought this would be really cool, just on a shelf with if you want greenery or whatever, whatever you want in there. Um, these were $2.99 for four of them. So they're just roosters. They're all exactly the same. So I like how they have, kind of reminds me, I can't remember what the, um, the stamp is, the IOD stamp. It's like script or something, but anyway. So I thought those were cool. And then I found, this was $2.99, just Raggedy Ann, and then she's holding a little Raggedy Ann, and she has like embroidery around her dress, and she's carrying a little, it's bedtime stories, and it says, I can hardly wait the nighttime falls when I climb into bed with my favorite dolls. So I really liked her. I always liked Raggedy Ann. 
All right, so here is so Mr. and Mrs. Claus salt and pepper holders. These were $2.99 also, but I thought those were really cute. And they both have the stopper, so that's always a plus. All right, so next I found, here's a little decanter. It's blue. This was also $2.99. I don't think I've ever seen the blue color, but I thought it was really pretty. So I grabbed that. I grabbed a champagne glass. We are actually doing, I'm doing a bridal shower in a few weeks, and um, so I got that to use for that for mimosas. This was also $2.99. It's like a pottery, but it has like the swing top lid. And I thought this was really cool. Just to set up on a shelf or decor. I don't know if you could, I like to make my own vanilla. And these are the type of bottles I use. So I don't know if I could use that for that or if I had to do something different. All right, I also got, these are Ironstone. Independence Ironstone. They're pink. So there's, let me see, one, two, three, four, six of these of the cups. And there's only one of them that has a super small chip right there. But, but I like that. And then it also came, I found the cream and then the sugar. The sugar, I'm sure, had a lid at some point. But this was $5.99 for the whole set, for the six cups and the cream and sugar. So I grabbed those, and I honestly don't think I've ever found Ironstone. So hopefully I'll find some. And then here's two little snowmen salt and pepper shakers. And I, did, I didn't notice this when I got it, but there's a couple super small chips right there. But like I said, I didn't even notice them when I bought it. But these were $2.99 for the set also. So I thought those were really cute. So that's actually my little haul for today. Um, I didn't have a ton of stuff, but I'm trying to go out more and more. All right, that's my thrift haul for today. I would love if you would comment and let me know what your favorite items were. If you think I should leave them, if you think they need an upcycle, give me, I'd love to hear what you have to say. So if you love this type of content, please be sure to subscribe so you can watch my other videos. Give me a like, a thumbs up, and also hit the notification button so you're notified when I post future videos. Have a great day, and I will see you next time.